He's Doogie the Sailor Dog. He's Doogie the Sailor Dog. La 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 la. Oh, <laughs> hello there. I'm Billy Blue Hair, and this is my seafaring dog, Doogie. It's a beautiful day to be out on the ocean. Wow, look at all that water, as far as the eye can see. What's wrong, boy? Oh, yep, the ocean goes down a long way, too. They don't call it the deep blue sea for nothing. So that brings us to a great question. How deep is the ocean? Well, before we talk about how deep it is, let's see how big it is first. If you were to look at planet Earth from outer space, you can see all the oceans in the world are connected. Even though they are all connected and look like one big ocean, there are actually five different oceans with five different names. The largest of all the oceans is the Pacific Ocean, then the Atlantic Ocean, the Indian Ocean, the Southern Ocean, and the smallest is the Arctic Ocean. Now if you were to add all the oceans together, you'd see they cover about 70% of the Earth's surface. It turns out planet Earth has more water than it has land. How crazy is that? Sure is a lot of water, but that's just the surface of it. But before we get into the nitty gritty of how deep the ocean is, here's a little teaser to whet your appetite. So, the tallest mountain in the world is Mount Everest, which is over 29,000 feet high. Now, if you were to take Mount Everest and drop it in the deepest part of the ocean, the very top of Mount Everest wouldn't even break the surface. That means parts of the ocean are deeper than the tallest mountain in the world. Pretty cool, huh? Well, now let's dive deeper into the facts, shall we? Now, because the ocean is so deep, scientists divide it into layers. Five, to be exact. Our little boat right here is floating on the top layer called the Sunlight Zone. This layer of the ocean goes from the surface down to about 650 feet. It's called the Sunlight Zone because this is as far as most sunlight gets. It's also where most sea life lives. Dolphins, jellyfish, and sharks call the Sunlight Zone their home. Okay, let's go down farther. The next layer below the Sunlight Zone is called the Twilight Zone. Sounds pretty mysterious, I must say. Even though not much light reaches the Twilight Zone, there's still a lot of life down here. Swordfish, squid, and some crazy stuff called bioluminescent organisms. Bioluminescent organisms make their own light, kind of like fireflies. Now, after the Twilight Zone, we enter the Midnight Zone. Wow, that sounds dark. And it is. It's pitch black. No light at all, except for some of our bioluminescent buddies, like the lanternfish. Oh yeah, and the giant squid. Stay down there, big fella. Moving down past the Midnight Zone, we reach the Abyss. And this zone is where most ocean floors lie. Sounds pretty ominous to me. The water temperature is near freezing, and just like the midnight zone above it, the abyss is totally dark. Except for the occasional sea pig. That's right, a sea pig lives all the way down here in the abyss. I don't think we'll be seeing this pig on the farm anytime soon. Okay, we have one more stop to make. Down we go! 20,000 feet, 25,000 feet, 30,000 feet, 35,000 feet. Whoa, Nellie! Now we've reached the deepest point of all these oceans. It's found in the Pacific Ocean and is called the Mariana Trench. The Mariana Trench is in a part of the Pacific Ocean called the Hadopelagic Zone. The Hadop... What? That's a crazy word. So most people just call it the trenches. 
and the trenches are home to some of the weirdest creatures ever. Sea cucumbers, tube worms, and the viper fish. Whoa, look at those teeth. Going up. Yikes, those guys were a little creepy. What a cold, dark world. I think I like it better up here in the sunlight zone with the dolphins. Boy, I'm getting wet today. So exactly how deep is the ocean? Well, the deepest point within the trenches is called Challenger Deep, which is approximately 36,200 feet deep. Now that's deep, deeper than the tallest mountain is tall. So deep that sunlight can't reach the bottom. A deeper place than most sea creatures can live. In a word, deep. In several words, 36,200 feet deep. Pretty neat, huh, Dukester? Uh, Doogie. Oh, Doogie, you crazy dog. Race you back to shore, boy. See you next time. He's Doogie the Sailor Dog. He's Doogie the Sailor Dog. So, wait.